This month is Leukemia and Lymphoma Awareness Month, so we have created this video to raise awareness about these cancers and do what we can for the people affected. Stick around to the end of the video to see what we're doing to help. Today we're going to do something different. We're going to do a money-making challenge with our friends Framed and C Engineer. Hey, Tempest Q! We are combining Frames Bronze Man Mode and C Engineer's PvP Hardcore Iron Man series. The rules are as follows. We have to follow all the rules of both of these series. We have to get all the items ourselves, and if we want to buy anything from the Grand Exchange, we have to unlock that within the challenge before we buy it from the Grand Exchange. For C Engineer's PvP Hardcore Iron Man, if he dies, he has to restart his account. But for this particular challenge, if we die, we have to restart the challenge, and all of our progress is wiped. So, with that said, I hope you guys have something planned for what moneymaker you're going to do. And you just sprung this on us. How would we have anything planned? <laughs> we'll all have five minutes to prepare, and then it's a 90-minute challenge. Whoever has the most money by the end of the 90 minutes wins the challenge. Wait, do we win something, or do we lose something? You get all of the profits of the other people, and the loser has to do something of the winner's choice. So oh, the winner in the no. second place can make them do anything, basically, <laughs> within reason. We'll, we'll make you do something embarrassing. Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, Kevin, do what do you lose? think about How do you feel about that? I don't want to lose now, man. So we start with untradables. Well, you can use untradables. I mean, they're not very helpful. I, I want to get some untradables. Oh, my God, dude. I just thought about it, too. In my rune pouch, which you can't trade, there's items in it, but I just don't return them out of the rune pouch. And then I can use all the runes. Incredible. <laughs> you guys are the slimiest. Kevin, yeah, are you doing like a Barney cosplay or something? You look like you really like Barney. <laughs> what do you mean, dude? Weirdo. What are you, what are you doing? A warp pipe for Mario cosplay, you retard? <laughs> so guys, I brought you here today because we're fighting Hodgkin's lymphoma. We're raising awareness for that because it's Leukemia and Lymphoma Awareness Month. So do you guys think that those things are bad? Obviously. <laughs> the fuck's your problem? <laughs> <laughs> um, like, I don't know what else to say. Do you think cancer is bad? <laughs> All right, gentlemen, uh, you have 90 minutes, and the start time is now. Wait. Good luck. Okay, so we have to do this in a PvP world. I uh, We're allowed to have the house tabs, thankfully. I think the best thing for me to do right away is to go and get the Mortmeyer fungus. Okay, really? I, that's how I start off, by sitting. Okay. Oh my god, it's so many people. All right, here we go. We're going to the ectophile. This is the first time I play on HD and it's so nice. We could bring all our untradeables, apparently. So we're gonna get some um, Mortmy Fungus. Get that real quick. Quick GP. I definitely didn't steal this idea from Campus and frame this. And apparently we had unlimited house teleports, which I'm gonna abuse on this challenge. Okay, first off, I'm getting Mortmy Fungus. I don't know how much this is worth. On the Grand Exchange, but I'm hoping it will sell for quite a bit. This is a very antiquated money-making method, so I hope it still works. The first inventory, and I hope it sells for a lot. 8k? No! I'm gonna be so poor by the end of this challenge. What the hell? I think the plan for me is to go to Barrows, ultimately. So I just need a bit of starting cash, and uh, I don't really have any other great plans. <laughs> Alright, one inventory, of course. Of course, I get everything. So I think I'm gonna just do this for a bit of starting cash. We should wear everything we can wear. <gasps> oh no, I accidentally teleported. All right, that should be enough. I actually have nothing planned, so we're just gonna wing this challenge. 4K, thank you. Oh my God, there's framed. He's using void. Oh my, how did he think of that? That's very smart. That is genius, actually. My feelings are hurt. Rub, we are going to the dig site. We're gonna test something out. The solo mission money maker. Buying steel nails and nails in general. Trade? We're gonna buy up all these steel nails. How much money do we get from this? Bam, bam. All right, panic dump everything. Oh my God. Even the sauce were good money. Oh my God, look at that. Hey! All right, we're making so much money. Look at my golden apron. Look at my merch. Thank you, Soup. Thank you. All right, uh, we are going to Warrior Skilled. I've always wanted to test out this money maker. I don't know if it works, but if you buy these things in this shop, look how cheap they are, like cheese potatoes. Buy 10, and they come to a price of 286 each. 
Oh, it's a scout bot. <laughs> oh yeah, I gotta be careful about those scout bots. All right, I think that should be enough. All right, sell these. Okay, second inventory. That's it, I'm going to revs. I need a knife and magic logs. Okay, yes, I have a knife. Beautiful. I'm gonna steal Kevin's method, get full void out of the bank. It's very high magic defense. I can't even make a magic short bow. I have 71 wood cutting. Oh my god. This is not a happy day. I'm gonna make a rune crossbow instead because I have the wood cutting and fletching levels required for that. Yeah, but that's the thing. I don't have the mining or smithing levels to make runite limbs. <laughs> I should have done more planning for this. Where do I even get to if I teleport with farming cape? Farming skill. Ooh, do I have anything here to do? We're taking a gamble here. It might be worth a lot. It might be worth nothing. Oh, I can't sell watering cans. I can't empty them. Oh my god. But I still think the watering can strat is a good strat. Rake, seed zipper, and watering can. Sell all these farming supplies. Let's go. So there's one thing I actually want to try out. I don't know if it's gonna work. He's got full void. Oh, wait. Full void, eh? That's a good strat, to be honest. How this didn't get recorded here, I don't know, but I went to the Warriors Guild and bought some stews and cheesy potatoes so I could unlock those. So that was my food source. All right, I don't want to go to Varrock Center because I feel like that is a death trap. Let's go to Watchtower. I want to go to Yanel. Okay, so here is what I am going to do. I'm going to come here, trade this guy. Please tell me I did hand sand. Good. All right, I want to get a Staff of Air. I'll just unlock both for now. Probably best to do Death Rune so I can make it through this whole thing. And I also want to buy Mystic Boots. But now I have this unlocked, so I can just cast... I guess I'll just do Wind Blast. It's whatever I have enough money for, honestly. Let's get a full inventory really quick of stews. Now I'll sell these. And how many Death Runes can I get? All right, with 100 Death Runes... Okay, there we go. I should be able to do a barrows run with this i don't know if this actually is going to work attack and experiment when these experiments attacks me with range they drop these shrunk ugly roots if you pick them up you can sell them in the grand exchange for 3k each but i don't know if they sell for that price so we'll have to try it out maybe it works maybe not but uh, i'm gonna go pee all right i'm back am i a billionaire yet how many do we get? Six. 30k worth of shrunk ugly roots so far. According to my calculations, if these sell for 3k each, we should have 2.4 mil after 90 minutes or after 80 minutes. So now the question is, will these sell? The moment of truth. How much can we sell these for? They're not even buying. Oh no, we got a problem. We got a massive problem here. Maybe someone will buy them over the next 80 minutes. Who knows? Maybe. Maybe I can even tweet it out. I'm going to make an adamant crossbow instead that has just a little less accuracy. Don't you do it. Don't you do it. Yes, there we go. Crossbow string made. Adamant limbs, please. Thank you very much. And then a quick trip to Prifendos to get my mahogany limbs. I haven't been here on HD yet. This is so beautiful. Wow, look at that. Oh, that's like a that's like a scene out of Star Wars or something. This is so cool. Need a hammer. How do I get a hammer? Hammer, give me. Thank you. Get me out of here. All right, no prayer and it's looking like 50 runes by the end of this. I don't think I'm going to be able to do Aram realistically and that does hurt my chances a bit you know i kind of have to do what i have to do okay please anything decent nope uh that really sucks i saw kevin he was wearing full void so we're doing the same can i make a magic short bow i think i can buy an axe make a magic short bow and then I kill something <gasps> oh my god this is huge this is huge could be massive give me a good seed Damn. What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. All right, we got a magic log. Sell everything else. I just know someone's gonna PK me, right? Of course there's a PK. But I got the knife. I got the knife. We can go to Camelot. Boom, boom. Magic short bow completed. What arrows are we doing? Whoa, someone bought everything up. Is this the best thing? I guess we're doing arrows, iron. I think there's better arrows at the range guild. Trade. Oh, here we go. The gold mine. I think we're going for Addy. Yeah, it's probably gonna be worth it. I'm talking too much. Shut up, Tom. My house is so bad. I don't have a Falador teleport anywhere. What is my problem? That's what I get for leaving it at 70 construction. Oh my God. Okay, 
I made it to the mining guild, I just need to get my hands on some adamant ore. Then I can make adamant bolts and make those into ruby bolts enchanted. Once I get my hands on ruby bolts, then I can sell or buy as many as I like from the grand exchange and then go to Vorkap. Yes, that was sooner than I expected with just a bronze pickaxe. My first adamant ore acquired. Now for the coal. And here we go, some bolts for me. Now I just need some rubies and runes to enchant them into ruby bolts E. I'm gonna have to improvise here. The plan for me is to get myself a dragon dagger so I will be able to do arums like semi okay, like semi decently. Quickly sell these items and then I can buy an amulet of glory really quick and then buy them all back. Wait, no, I'm not allowed to do that. I'm not allowed to do that. Oh my god. <laughs> This challenge is so hard. Okay, I haven't cheated yet. I haven't cheated yet. We're gonna buy ourselves a nose pick and rock hammer. Give us something good. Rune Felham, first kill. That's a beautiful 30k. Wait, there's gotta be a better money maker than this. Maybe Kemp will share some ideas here. No, no. C Engineer did not just message me that. Oh my god, no way. This guy. This guy asking the competition for help. But to be fair, okay, Kevin doesn't know I really want him to lose because he won the last challenge. So I'm going to ally with C Engineer here and I'm going to try to help C Engineer as much as I can. He's telling me to go gargoyles. Is he? All right, uh, I'm, I don't want to talk to him. All right, maybe skill specs. All right, we all skill specs. Maybe, yes, maybe he has some good advice. Oh, steel bars, thank you. What game is he playing? Oh, this guy is so cool. Oh. Oh, man, I feel like he's taking advantage of me here. <laughs> he just like turns his private off right after. He, he probably thinks I'm a huge noob. I might have given him really bad advice. I don't know. Don't forget Void because like Camp is giving me all the advice I already know. That is so smart, man. I had no idea. Thank you. And skill specs ignore me like always. That is so smart, man. I had no idea. Thank you. Is he being sarcastic with me? Tom, that is no way to treat me, okay? I'm trying to help you. That's worth 583 GP. That's it. I'm winning this challenge. Okay, so I have a bit under an hour left. And the cash stack's not looking great, but it's fine because that was just to get starting cash. Okay, so now I am going to unlock two things. One, I am unlocking strength potions. And two, I am unlocking a dragon dagger. Okay, and once more, all of my money is going to be going on death runes. Four death runes. Uh, well, this should be an interesting run, to say the least. Yes, we got it. Rune plate legs. 37k, beautiful. All right, I've asked a few people. Hydra Solra. Knowing my history, it's probably not a good idea for me. Do barrels, get the runes, go to Zolra, profit. That's our plan. Wait, could we go for the back-to-back? -back? We got a rune full of him. Could we potentially get the back-to-back? -back? Never lucky. All right, we're done here. Teleport away. Okay, well, I've gotten every single gem except for the one I need. Perfect. Today's not my lucky day. We're 33 minutes into the challenge and I have 620 GP. <laughs> this is such a waste of time. Okay, this one Vorkath kill that I might get at the end of the challenge better be worth it. No, I forgot you can buy rubies from Keldergrim. I was just doing that on my Iron Man. No. Oh my god. I've already been to Keldergrim this challenge. I completely forgot. This is embarrassing. This is, I'm going to get roasted so hard by Framed and C Engineer. Oh my god. Rubies aren't sold out. I pray. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, good. Craft a ruby sickle? No. I don't. Do I have to drop my silver sickle? No, 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 no. What does that do? I don't know what this does. I'm scared. Please make ruby bolt tips. Yes. Okay, good, good, good. And then I can buy my adamant bolts back because I already made them in the challenge. There are my feathers. There are my ruby bolt tips. Now I just need to make a trip to the mage bank in order to get some cosmic runes. Okay, okay. Moving up in the world. Got almost 20k cash. Pretty good. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I figured there might be some complications with Toreg. Melee is definitely not the way to go all the way throughout this journey. <laughs> Perfect. Let me just get 88 or as close to it as I can. So I have the best potential for rewards. All right, 86. That's pretty good. Uh, I mean, honestly, that's not bad. That refreshes the runes for the next run. So we're good. I'll take that. All right, we're going in the right direction here. Blood runes, fire runes. Two barrels. We go with fire waves. Barrels, barrels. There we go, barrows. Is anyone doing barrows? Wait, I could actually get an imbued magic cape as well. It's untradeable. <gasps> Someone was here! Alright, good luck to me. 87%. 
nothing. We got some runes though. Can't complain. Now, if I buy one of each type of rune, then for whatever reason, if I need them in the future, I can buy them from the Grand Exchange. Perfect. Okay, good. Now, I just need to enchant these. Switch spellbook really quick. I need blood runes. How do I get those? Okay, please don't tell me I require a task. Yes. Okay, I can kill these blood velts and hopefully get a blood rune. I was able to buy 100 item and bolts from the Grand Exchange because I've already made a lot of these throughout this challenge. Yes, I got blood runes, 30 of them too. Okay, that's actually a very good profit. Look at me, excited over 12k GP. All right, another chest, something. Nope. Um, that's okay. That's honestly okay. I think that's going to make it a bit better. So as of right now, it's a little bit risky. Let me sell that. Let me sell that. I'm going to just put all of this in blood runes. But I'm thinking that if I dump all my money into blood runes, this will go by faster. Yeah, this is going by a lot faster. I think this is the right call, even if it is a bit more expensive. Pretty much, I'm just really trying to gamble here and hoping that this pays off. Enchant these bad boys. Yes, Ruby Bolts E. Okay, perfect. Yes, okay, I do have some redeeming stats on this account. I have 99 cooking, so I can buy a raw shark from this Canifis food store. Then I can get as many raw sharks as I need. I should actually just cook one of them, and then I can buy cooked sharks on the Grand Exchange. But I only have 5k, so before my Vorkath attempt, I really need to make a little more money. I'm gonna buy a rock hammer, and I'm gonna kill some gargoyles. I hope Sea Engineer's not there, or unfortunately, I'm gonna have to kill him. Probably have a little bit better weaponry than he does, but so he may just be slain in the next couple minutes here. I'm making this whole challenge so I can make it so that if I PK anything from either of these other competitors, I get to keep it towards my money at the end of the challenge. So yeah, that, that's the new rule. I just made it up and uh, we're going to go with it. Is C Engineer here? I don't see him. No, he's not here. Sad. I got a Rune 2 8 sword first kill. Yes. Oh, that's amazing. Beautiful Rune Full Helm. All right, it's time to get out of here. I have enough money and there's only 31 minutes left on the timer, so I better get a kill of Warcalf very, very soon here. Of course, it's Kevin. Kevin was here. I got an idea. And what you are about to witness is incredible. All right, back to Barrows. I hope Kevin is there. I need to find him. I need to find Kevin, shuck a TV on his head. Oh, that would be so fun. I'm gonna be such a snake if I get the opportunity. All right, 84%, good luck. Never lucky. All right, another chest and C Engineer is here also. So this is gonna be a little interesting. Okay, um, 45K, let's get some more stews. You know what? We can actually get cheese potatoes at this point. While I'm here, maybe I can just spec out someone. Probably not, let's be real. But like, maybe. This is not going to work. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, it was a nice idea. <laughs> nice idea. <laughs> Where is he? He's kind of PK me. <laughs> I just TV'd Kevin. <laughs> I kind of figured he was going to do that. That's why I kind of figured I should just do this, you know? So good try, Tom, but it didn't really work. <laughs> Just TV Kevin. Why is he schooled up? <laughs> ah, that's too good. That's too good. <laughs> We're PKers, man. We just think about how we can rag somebody else and inconvenience them in the most annoying way. <laughs> I wonder if he's mad right now. <laughs> thinks I'm teleblocked still. Like, I'm not gonna log out, dude. Come on. As long as he thinks I'm teleblocked, that's fine. I don't care. All right, so uh, now that I'm not teleblocked, I'm gonna go get more spec and food. Okay, so now it's time to get some upgrades. Hopefully we get an armor drop, though. Uh, no, I guess, <laughs> guess not. That's fine. Let's go get some upgrades now. Can I cook my shark in my large oven in my kitchen? Better be able to. Beautiful. 99 cooking coming in. Now I just need a super anti-poison. Gotta get myself a ring mold. Perfect. Smelt the gold bar and make an emerald ring. And I gotta enchant this real quick. Please? Yes, beautiful. Okay, quickly. Headed to Castle Wars and please don't kill me. The famous one dose super anti-poison. Now I can buy three more of these on the Grand Exchange, make a four dose and bring that to Vorkath. Now I'm making diamond bolts as well. I'm so glad I bought all the runes from the mage shop so that I can actually enchant these. Yes, there we go. Diamond bolts made as well. All right, um, here we go. Three, two, one, blood runes, all right. Okay, so I'm gonna sell this, gonna buy this, I'm gonna buy one air rune. At this point, I'm just gonna do barrels until I either get an item or the time runs out. Oh, 
What is he trying? He can't PJ here anyway. Ah, oh, he teleported. I wonder if he got something. He's probably celebrating a Carol's top drop right now as we speak. 85% for nothing. Oh my god, I almost... I'm so dumb. The last thing I need, rare potions. And you can get them from Maniacal Monkeys, so I gotta hurry this up. No, you need a light source. Oh my god. <laughs> this is not going well. <laughs> This is not going well at all. All right, screw it. I'm gonna try to prayer flick the entire thing. Give me the anti-dragon shield quickly. Thank you. All right, this is the inventory. We're all set. Time to slay Vorkath. I got 16 minutes left, so... Uh, <laughs> can I get one kill? I just pray for one kill, man. I'm not gonna lie, I completely forgot how to kill this boss, but I'll give him my best shot. I have no other choice at this point. Oh, there we go. There's the proc. No, don't die, Martin. I'm not gonna die here! I'm lagging! It's not my fault if I die, I'm lagging. No way! No! 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 Oh my god! No, I can't believe this! I can't believe this! No, 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 no. That's a reset wipe as well. I can't even collect my stuff back. Could we potentially shuck a TV on frame? Hey. 82%? We got something! Wait, this is such a bad item! That doesn't matter. This is the important part. Oh, don't you dare PG me. Yeah! <laughs> He's stuck! He's stuck and we got an item! A Carol's crossbow. 109k. Alright, we're gonna sell this. We got 9 minutes. I have unlocked Sapphire. There we go. Sapphire ring. We got 6 minutes to kill Zora. I set myself the goal to kill Zora and that's what I'm doing. Wait. Where, where can I buy cosmic runes? Oh, Priftinus. Oh my god. No way. Why I couldn't even teleport away? It's four minutes left, it's over. It's actually over. Ah oh, no, that's so depressing. Wait, I might be able to loot my stuff back. This is depression. Depression at its finest. Is he giving it back? He's giving it back. And I, I feel like this is against the rules. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve it. Ah, oh, no way that just happened. Well, we're back to where we started. Did I learn anything? I learned that I'm an idiot. That's pretty much it. But that's not what it's about. It's about the friends we made along the way. We have one chance left to win this. Skills picks. He's streaming right now. If he dies, we can potentially loot things up. You got two minutes to die, Jay. Jay, you got two minutes to die. This is the only chance I'm not losing. Come on, Jay. Oh, oh almost. Th that should have been the kill. One minute, 30 seconds. Come on. Dragon Axe. He's the... Oh, oh. No way. All right. How do I... All right. We, we got one more chance. We got one more chance here. Yeah, insult to entry. Kick a man while he's down. Oh no. Stop it. Stop. Why is the world so cruel? Oh my god, if he kills me with that, please don't let that damage register. Oh my god, this is so close. This is literally the closest thing ever. Come on, hurry up and die, dude. Please. Rambo. You're gonna have to Rambo here. Varric is just not gonna die. It doesn't matter. Oh god. 35 seconds to get this chest. Oh my god, of course it's all the way on the south. Well, you know, I am not gonna make this um in time, but you know, to be fair, this whole thing is uh, you know, because we hate cancer. And cancer cheats, right? Cancer is unfair. So uh, if cancer is going to cheat, then I'm going to cheat just a little bit. And look at that. Okay, hold on. Just, nothing's happening. You don't see this. You don't see this. Oh my God. With one second left. Look at that. Okay. Well, I probably deserve that then. <laughs> Well, that's it. That's the uh, hour and a half. Let's sell everything and see what we get. 155K. That is hot garbage dude 155670 oh, there's a very real chance i lost here let's go find out well see engineer i'm relying on you to take framed out of this he's got to lose this one he's got to lose one challenge i mean unless either of them died in the last five minutes then uh you know i, I have a chance i have a chance to take second place here with my 36k oh, oh wait 43k mm. <laughs> i got 20 seconds to kill him 17 16 15 14 I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. It's over. 
It is actually... The time is up. The time is up. And I died for everything. I still got my Shrank Ugly Roots. If someone died, I might have won. Like, I have a potential chance here. Alright, we sold them. We got 3,755k. Alright, we got 8 Shrunk Ugly Roots and 3,771 GP. So according to the tracker, it doesn't show on the screen, I made 345k from Barrows, 132k from Gargoyles, and a bit more from buying stuff. So here we are. Oh my god, they are all in their gear while I'm naked. This is not good. They, they're gonna know something. Man, there's a very real chance I lost here. Yeah, I'm afraid you did. I, I just got really lucky. I'm not even gonna say anything, but I, I got so lucky. I, I just don't think there's a chance for you guys, honestly. This All is right. an easy win. <laughs> oh no, I definitely lost. <laughs> I'm afraid I won, Tom. Insane RNG, I've never had this in all of my 16 years of playing RuneScape, I just had incredible luck. So you guys are gonna have a hard time winning this one, but I'm excited to hear what you guys got. Tom goes first then. Tom goes first, then you, then me. No, no, no. I, I think I should go last, honestly. I think I should go last. You think you should go last? <laughs> I think I should go last. Okay, I'll I'll go first. I'm gonna type. All right. No, wait, no, no. I should I shouldn't go first. Kevin, you should go Kevin. first. Okay, fine. How about we all type it at the same time? <laughs> yeah, I agree. Okay. I will. We'll, we'll say three, two, one, go. So okay, type it all go. out. It's you, a long you, number. I have to type out. So hold on. Yeah, I'm sure. Like Tom died somehow. Yeah. Nice <laughs> Just looking at him. I feel All like right. he might have died. All right, I'm ready. I'll say three, two, one, go. Ready? Three, two, one, go. <laughs> no fucking way. What? <laughs> <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> Wait, are we all so bad at this game? See, Engineer, what happened? What? <laughs> what? Happened? He died. I, I guarantee I, he died. I should have won this. I like. I would have guaranteed one. If I didn't die. Oh my god, how'd you die? How'd it happen? I teleported to my house, I went outside, I thought my house was in Priftonis. It wasn't, it was in Remington. <laughs> and a rusher is there, oh, and he no. rushes me out. I couldn't teleport out as well because of the delay of teleporting too quickly, so I, I just died. <laughs> Dude, I, I literally thought that I was so screwed God and you know damn what? it frame yeah. one again frame and one I, again I, I no like, I just felt like when you said I've never had this insane luck that you were just lying <laughs> I just felt oh like it was a straight up lie wait Kemp how are you so bad what did you do <laughs> I I died too I spent the entire time crafting my way up fletching an adamant crossbow making bolts trying to go to Vorkath. And then the That's first Vorkath kill, I died. <laughs> it took me an hour and 10 minutes to get to Vorkath, and then I die on the first KC. Oh my god. <laughs> I didn't get a single kill. Both of you should have won, but you both died of complacency. Oh, oh my well. god. Okay, well, this is the exact same order placement as the last challenge we did. It looks like the engineer <laughs> is gonna have to do something embarrassing again. Oh, and also, well, let's trade over, oh trade over your GP to, to framed. He deserved it. I don't fucking want it, dude. <laughs> Uh, wow. Give it to me. And the uh, ugly roots, right? Yeah, thank you, man. <sighs> Just take my bank. I don't like this. <sighs> you have to cheer 500 bits along with it, too. So copy and paste that so, message exactly. I, I feel like That's I understand that. Yeah. Oh, he's going in. He's going in. No! Yo, see engineer. Dude. underscore engineer cheered. X500. Hey, Rexy, Your videos used to be good, man. What happened? <laughs> smiley face. <laughs> A skeptical smiley face saying, <laughs> "Hey, bro, listen, I may have, uh, I may have bitten off more than I could chew with this series, man. It's been, uh, it's been a roller coaster." Oh. Uh, <laughs> oh. Dude, you're, you're making me feel <laughs> bad now. You're just an <laughs> asshole now, man. You said that, not us. <laughs> Why, would that? That, Why would you say that? Why would you say that, Tom? Say that, man. You make me feel so bad. You just made him say, "Where did I go wrong?" Fuck you, Tom. You're such an asshole, bro. <laughs> Dude, you, you're making me feel so bad right now. You're such an <laughs> asshole, bro. Why would you say that to someone? You can tell him that is part of his forfeit. Yeah. <laughs> but instead, I'm about 400 mil away from my... <laughs> 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 Why did you make me do that? Now the skill specs is... He hosted Matt K! No, no, that was this uh, wonderful car. Uh, you, have to, you have to talk shit to Matt K you now. You want. Oh my god, I have such a dickheaded message. <laughs> I have such a dickheaded message. Ah, <laughs> uh, you're gonna make me write that, huh? <laughs> <laughs> hey, 
Casey Engineer. How you doing, buddy? Thank you for the 500 bits, mate. Jaggers is so much <laughs> better off without you, man. Love you, brother. Jaggers is so much better off without you, man. Love you, brother. I think that's a thank you. <laughs> I guess there's a typo in there. <laughs> Oh shit, kind of mistyped that, sorry. <laughs> I did the same, I remember putting out a tweet like, sorry. Bro. I think he oh, definitely just right, assumed that it's a language barrier. <laughs> yeah. We put this video together for you because we are raising awareness for leukemia and lymphoma. These are fierce cancers that affect just over 1 million people in the United States. A friend of mine asked me to contribute to Abby's fight against Hodgkin's lymphoma, and I thought she would be the perfect candidate to talk about in this video. From what I've heard of Abby, she's a very thoughtful, positive, and generous person. She suddenly developed nasty symptoms and was told she had cancer within her lymph nodes, collarbone, upper chest, and throat. It is curable, but the insurance company won't pay all her medical expenses to get her cured. So along with spreading awareness, we are trying to contribute as much as we can. Any amount contributed would mean a lot to her and her family. As a fun extra bonus, we're also hosting a raffle for people that donate. All you have to do is add the letters YT to the end of your donation name. Donate $5 or more to Abby's GoFundMe for a chance at winning a Corsair K70 RGB TKL keyboard. Or $50 or more for a chance at a custom Ironside PC with an i5 processor and an RTX 3060. We really do need your help to hit the goal of the GoFundMe page, so please use the link in the description below to contribute. We are trying to crush out Abby's Hodgkin's lymphoma. And thank you to ExpressVPN for sponsoring this video because I'll be donating every penny towards her GoFundMe page. ExpressVPN, I use them almost every time I use the internet. It's simple, they protect me while I browse the web. Internet service providers can and do sell my data to ad companies. Governments, large corporations, and websites are surveilling me constantly and harvesting my data. ExpressVPN stops the spying by rerouting my IP address to one of 94 countries across the globe. It also keeps my internet speeds fast, has the best encryption in the business, and has been rated the number one VPN by some of the most reputable tech publications. I purchased ExpressVPN well before they sponsored me. And if the perks are interesting to you, go to expressvpn.com slash chemq to learn how to get three months for free, or you can use the link in the description. Thanks to them for letting us contribute more to Abby's fight against cancer. 